Unfortunately, most of us know someone with breast cancer. Almost every minute, someone in the world dies from the breast cancer. The best protection is seen as early detection. Currently, the main method for screening of the breast cancer is X-ray mammography. But X-ray radiation is dangerous, so it cannot be used repeatedly. Also, X-ray mammography is prone to false diagnosis, and it is painful since the breast tissue has to be compressed. So we need a better screening method with higher safety, accuracy, and comfort. Now, imagine a cell phone could detect breast cancer. While we are not there yet, my research is going in that direction. In the next 10 years, microwave imaging system could replace to X-ray mammography. Microwave imaging system will send out a very weak signal, 1,000 times less than a mobile phone, through the breast tissue. Then, the signal will be picked up by a large number of tiny antennas around the breast tissue. Finally, the system will build up a 3D image of inside of the breast tissue. This system has a very complicated design. Before doing clinical trials, we have to prove that this system performs reliably for all different patients with thousands of variations of breast tissues and tumors in terms of shape, size, density, and so on. This can only be done in a computer. And electromagnetic modeling will help us to move from real life to the computer and do our testing. In this regard, traditional electromagnetic modeling have two problems. Firstly, they need long-time simulations. For example, sometimes it takes more than one week to do one simulation, which means more than one decade for 1,000 simulations. Secondly, they need to use supercomputer, so the cost is very high. This is where my thesis comes in. In my thesis, I am going to solve these two problems. I am developing a new mathematical algorithm to model and predict the behavior of electromagnetic waves inside different breast tissues in a computer much more efficiently than traditional methods. My results so far indicate that, firstly, my algorithm is much faster than traditional method. Just imagine we can do one of our simulation in one day instead of one week. Secondly, my algorithm can be applied in a simple computer instead of a supercomputer, so it costs less. So my algorithm for electromagnetic modeling is much faster and cheaper. This could be the first step to have a simple device like a mobile phone to detect breast cancer. This simple device could be carried in a backpack, could be used safer without pain, and will save lives. Thanks. Thank you, Zara. And Mark, you have a question? Thank you. That was fascinating. I'm wondering what types of other tissues could this technology be used on? I mean, is it only limited to soft tissue, or could it be used for brain tumors as well? Yeah, that's a very interesting question. Um, many researchers working on microwave imaging system, not only for detection of breast cancer, but also for other diseases like brain stroke and heart attack and so on. So, yeah, the, the answer is yes, we can use it for uh, detection of other diseases as well. Thank you again.